Welcome to the Bake Like a Pro YouTube channel. In today's really fun video, I'm going to show you how to make that magic shell coating that you put on ice cream. For today's recipe, we're only going to need two ingredients. I have half a cup of coconut oil. This is equal to exactly 100 grams. And our second ingredient, some semi-sweet chocolate. I have exactly 144 grams here. This is equal to almost one cup. It's just shy of one cup. So those are the ingredients, so let's get started. Today's recipe is really simple. Grab your chocolate, pour it into a heat proof bowl, and then put in all of your coconut oil. And what's really cool about coconut oil is it, it starts melting at a very low temperature. If you take your finger and just put it on a little bit of the oil, you'll see it melting right away. And this is what's magic in this recipe, is that it keeps the chocolate in a liquid form. Okay, that's good. Now I'm going to set up my little double boiler and I'll be back in one second. I have a pot with some hot water. I'm just going to place my bowl on top and now I'm just going to let all of this gently heat together. So we're just going to leave it on there for a few minutes. It'll start melting and then I'll come back. If you don't want to do the double boiler method, you can do this directly in your little pot. Just make sure that you use a very low heat. You do not want to scorch your chocolate. So we'll let that go and I'll come back in a couple of minutes. So this is about five minutes later. You can see that all of the coconut oil has melted. And now I'm just gonna take my whisk and I just wanna start whisking all of this together. And you can see how liquid this is. But as soon as you pour this over cold ice cream, it freezes up immediately. And I'll show that to you later on. So right now this is warm. But you can see how nice that is, look at this. It really is magic. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let this completely cool and then I'll come back. Here we are about an hour later. My coconut oil and chocolate has completely cooled. And you can see at this point how fluid this still is. Now if this had been just chocolate, you would actually start seeing the chocolate getting very, very thick, but you can see how fluid this is. And this here is perfect to be pouring on some nice ice cream of your choice. So at this point, I'm gonna get this into a little bottle and then we're going to try some out on some nice ice cream. Let's just give it a stir. all of that right into a little mason jar. Mm, this smells really amazing with that coconut oil in there. There we have it. That smells amazing. As promised for the last little bit of my video, I just wanted to show you how well this works. So here I've got a little bit of ice cream. I just put a couple of scoops and then I just squeezed it down a little bit just to make it flat so that a little bit more of that chocolate mixture will actually sit on the top of the ice cream. We'll get in here and you can see again how fluid this is. So let's get some on there and watch how quickly this solidifies. Let's get all of that on here. And you know there's not a lot in this bottle it doesn't seem like it, but this little amount goes quite a long way. So we'll just let that sit like that. And now I'm just gonna zoom in. So I'll leave the camera going. Try to do this in real time. Let's zoom in here. That's about as good as I'm gonna get. Yeah, and right now you can already see, hopefully the camera's picking that up. It might be a little bit dark. I'll just get a little spoon and I'll just tap it. Listen, it's already solid right in this area here. Right now, just within a few seconds, this is solidifying as well. So the magic part of this recipe is that coconut oil. If you live in an area in your country where you have warm weather all the time, you're never gonna see this chocolate mixture solidify. 
If you live in an area where it is a little bit cooler, you will see it solidify. If it does, you can take this and just put it in the microwave 15 seconds or so on defrost and that will just bring it to this liquid state again. Or what you can do is you can take the bottle and just put it into a little bit of warm water and that will do the same trick. And here we are, it's all solid right now. And I'll just grab, listen to this, a nice snap to it and there we have it. Really, really nice. That coconut oil as well gives a really, really nice flavor to the chocolate. So that's it for this really fast video. I hope you enjoyed it. Try this out. It is amazing. That's it for today. If you're on Facebook, you can check me out, facebook.com slash bakelikeapro. If you enjoyed my video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you wish. I really do appreciate that. That's it, and I'll see you next time.